surprisingly enough, I'm actually home. And it's still light outside. We're not starting today's vlog at 9 o'clock at night, which is really, really nice. I was really hoping today I would get lucky. My hall center tracking is said for Saturday, which is tomorrow. But I was hoping, you know, sometimes you get lucky it comes the day before. I don't think it's going to happen unless it comes a bit later, but I doubt that. So either way, we're prepping the car complete today. Wiring harness all plugged in, uh, coolant, oil, everything in the car ready to go. So when it comes tomorrow, it's just one little swap, top pieces on, and we can try and start her up. So today I went and picked up coolant. G13, uh, power steering fluid, and some distilled water. Uh, make sure for these cars, if you use anything besides this, I'm told, um, it'll squeak. Your power steering pump will squeak and be all annoying and noisy, so make sure CHF for stuff you want. It looks like a pretty big mess, but it honestly, it shouldn't be too bad to do. It's just plug everything back in, and I already know where everything goes. I, I had someone to put the coolant oil in, but there's a big gaping hole there, so we'll hold off for all the fluids until tomorrow, but I will drain the oil out of this one and put a new filter in just so it's ready, and then tomorrow we'll do coolant, all the rest of the fluids, and I think it's ready to go. It's just nice actually seeing a motor in this car again, the one that's actually going to run, because last time we were never going to get it right because it was machined wrong, but this one actually ran fine before, so we should be completely 100% good to go. While I saw some decent light, I'm going to do the axles first and just keep going from there. find the right words and there's no way this is real life there's no telling you're the right girl so i can only say that it feels right it feels right it feels right yeah i can only say that it feels right Kind of hard to see, but axle one and axle two are both bolted in. Up next will be to bolt the exhaust manifolds down and then get back into the car and attach my exhaust again. I'm very happy to say progress is going very, very smooth today. Headers are now on and on nice and tight. Don't have any exhaust sleeves and also down at the bottom. Also bolted up. Up next, I'm going to go ahead and crack the oil pan drain bolt. Drain all the oil out of this one and pull the oil filter off. And then we get started on this nonsense. Back when I was talking to Carlos before I actually bought this motor, he said he changed the oil about a month ago, so it's still super fresh. But we want to have brand new oil. And I also want to run my fancy T6 Rotella with the man filter. I kind of like the Mark IV oil pan because the drain bolt's in the back, so like you can't scrape it off the bottom. But it's also kind of irritating because it's also on the back versus like right in the bottom. There's goods and bads, but it'll be alright. Oh, that's so cool. <sighs> So as you just saw, I'm pretty sure I didn't like fully round it off, but you can see where the teeth are sliding. This is a 36 millimeter socket, which is the size that's supposed to be for the bottom of the overdoor housing. Um, but it's a plastic like top piece like this is like it's plastic like this. And plastic is not good for like you know metal trying to spin it because eventually it starts to break. I'm pretty sure there's a metal um, oil filter cap you can get, which I definitely want to get because this one's garbage. But now it's a fun fact of how I'm going to get it off because I'm trying to get it off with the socket and it's just spinning around. Alright, with a quick scour of the internet we have found them. Billet oil filter housing caps, black or polished, like that's clear. There's a couple here. 66 bucks, 78 bucks, 99. I'll probably go with probably like this one. But yeah, we're not dealing with this plastic garbage no more. Alright, I was going to use this, but this isn't fitting there, so nice grip it is. Why are you on so tight? What are you talking about? <coughs> Ugh. Why in the world are you on there that tight? There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Wow, how's it going? And we're all set to go. Old filter out, new filter in. I didn't realize this man filter here. Look at that right there. Made in Germany, look at that, versus STP, Manchata. So, told you, man filter, that's the way to go. Now that everything under the car is done, we can start going through the harness and just spraying it back out and getting plugged in. Never had a doubt, felt like 
this is just a must. Moving right along, just about everything is plugged and ready to go, aside for some things like back here, like the mass sensor that obviously isn't there yet, but everything else that is here is hooked up, alternator, compressor, all the fuel lines are hooked up, and all of this stuff. Up next will be the clutch, oh, not the clutch, oh, sorry, the shift linkage here, the slave cylinder line that goes in, and then after that, I can put the front end on, and I can do the front lining harness and that kind of stuff, and then mostly we'll be the done. Deepest in the cut, everybody tuning in, but this is just for us now. We know I ain't balling yet, hoes wanna holler, oh no, I don't call them back. Girl, let me see you, hold it down, we gon' have a blast. Cause I just wanna know what you gonna do with all of that, ain't gotta say a word. I know what's up, you can have it all, watch me rip it all. I'll admit it, you got me feeling hella love, even when it's going down. Just about done for the night. The last thing to do is put the front end back on Miley. Once we do that, it's all over for the day. And then tomorrow, the last few pieces, like the spark, uh, the coal pack, spark plug, the wires, um, the coolant tank, that kind of stuff. Just some tiny, tiny, small things. And then we go for the first startup. And then hopefully after that first startup, we're driving right away. Everything is ready to go. It's just those last few pieces and we're Golden, we're so close. We're so close. going down, know that we gon' live it up. Young shot caller, always been a baller. Know that you the one, I can feel it in my heart. Yeah, I won't stop charging. We going come harder. I can see you and I, way beyond the stars, girl. I can never ever find the right words. And there's no way this is real life. There's no telling you're the right girl. So I can only say that it feels right. I'm not gonna lie, seeing this car, like, ooh, this is how I felt the very first time I did this. Now, this time around, I'm, uh, I'm excited, like I know it's gonna work, or I hope it's gonna work, but I'm, I'm hesitant to get excited, because last time I was so hyped up, and I was so excited, and it just came crashing down, so this time, like, I, I'm very confident in it, I'm taking my time, I, I wanna get super excited, but I'm gonna just hold back until the car, is literally driving down the street. That's what I'm gonna get fully, fully excited. But right now, I mean, like, even though this, whew, it's been a long time since Miley has had. Oh yeah, look at that. Dig! I'm so excited. I'm gonna try not to get too excited, but I, I'm so, so excited. Everything's all hooked up, buttoned up, pretty much. Few last pieces go tomorrow. We can try and start her up and then take her for her first drive. Oh, please, please, please just continue to go well. Nothing was touched motor-wise. It should work, no problem. Please just work. I don't know, I'm excited, but I'm nervous. I'm also very, very proud because today is Friday, almost Saturday. We bought this engine, well we bought the engine about a week ago. It didn't get home until Sunday. In that time, we torn it completely down, built it all the way back up, pulled my other motor out, tore that one down, Got everything reassembled and just about, I say under a week, then you got here Sunday. And under one week, we've done all that, and hopefully tomorrow is the final day and she's running ready to go. I know you guys want to see this car run. Believe me, I want to see it run a million times more than you. It sucks walking out into the garage and seeing your car just sit here, and that's all it's doing. It's just sitting there, but we're close. We we're so close. Oh, send prayers. Send all of the prayers. Tomorrow is the day. I don't know exactly what time EPS comes. Usually it's like early afternoon-ish, like 12, 1 o'clock. Hopefully they're right on time. Get that part, knock it out, and then by tomorrow afternoon, Greg and I should be driving around twin BR6s, tearing up St. Cloud. That's the plan. Ah. Ah, that is a plan. Come on, Miley, you got this. You got this. Do not forget, be thankful for every single day. I will see you guys tomorrow. Peace. Hey, I was doing just fine before I met you. I drank too much and that's an issue, but I'm okay. Tell your friends it was nice to meet them But I hope I never see them again I know it breaks your heart